Hello, Pisces. This is your reading for the 14th through the 15th. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. What's going on with Pisces and love for the 14th through the 15th? Pisces. What's going on with Pisces and love? Please show me. Six of Cups. Missing someone, I feel. Somebody's missing you as well. Somebody that you have um, a history with. You feel uh, right at home with this person, okay? You feel like this is your soulmate. Will of Fortune. There's some changes going on here in your situation. Hmm. Could be a Scorpio, Sagittarius. Um that you are thinking about but there's somebody that feels like they would like to see some change as far as the circumstances are right now okay feeling like you guys have been through too much to just let it fall to the wayside five of swords I'm getting a strong sense that um, a lot of you are probably wanting to, even though you miss this person, you feel like you've been in a cycle with this person. Um, you care for this person, but I'm getting that you guys are feeling like, you know, it's time for you to move forward. But there's somebody that's trying to turn back the clock here. Aquarius energy. Somebody's trying to turn back the, the clock here. Somebody's also fighting change in this situation. Not just that they don't want the other one to move on, but um, somebody's trying not to look at themselves to see what they could possibly do in this situation to you know make things better please show me more about the six of cups more for the six of cups please we have the ace of wands here and we have the four of cups I'm getting strongly that one of you, like I said, both of you miss each other, but I'm getting from you guys that you're wanting to, you're wanting to move forward. You're wanting to, you're wanting to see change in your, in your personal life. Okay. And that's, I'm getting, this is you guys here. Um, not really thinking about reconnecting, not really accepting any loving offers or not wanting to because it's like right now you're just finding your stability, finding your security, okay? And, um, and I'm getting this was probably the love of your life is what you're feeling. And now that it's gone haywire, um, you're just not, you're not willing to extend is what I'm getting here. But there's somebody else here that wants a new start. There's somebody else here that wants a new start. And I'm getting it. Um, it's whoever this Five of Swords energy is, Aquarius energy. Um could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or somebody with that energy that is wanting to start over and, and really does not want you guys to move on without them. Somebody definitely wants to reunite, reconnect, feeling very att attracted to you guys here. Okay, so show me more about the Wheel of Fortune. Show me more about the Wheel of Fortune. 
death. Definitely. This is all about ending things. Ending was not working for you. That's not vibing with you. You're wanting to let something go here and move forward. You want to see a change. You are changing. You're transforming. Scorpio energy there. Scorpio, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, possibly. Show me more about the Five of Swords, please. Show me more about the Five of Swords. Nine of Pentacles, definitely somebody coming in. I feel that um, they're moving in very slowly. But I'm, I'm sensing that they're feeling the energy of you guys wanting to move on. They're not wanting you to, not without them. They see success with you. And, and I'm also getting that it feels a little selfish because... I'm feeling like there's something that's going on in your life right now that this person has taken notice of. And um, it looks like you are successful in whatever it is that you have started um, since them. And they want how to say this. Now, of course, when you're doing bad, you can do bad by yourself. But when you're doing well, then people want to jump on the bandwagon because they want to do well with you. It's like they don't want to see you doing good without them. Okay. Um, so it is like a selfish energy because it's like, where were you when I was down and out? Okay. Okay. You didn't come to my aid. You didn't want to stand by my side. But now that you see that I'm doing well, it's like, now you want to come back? So, take heed to that, guys, okay? Taurus energy there. Maybe Virgo Capricorn, okay? <clears throat> Who's coming towards Pisces? Who's coming towards Pisces? Who's coming towards Pisces? I'm almost feeling jealousy here. Who's coming towards Pisces? King of Wands. Stubborn energy. Somebody that may think they're the shit. That their shit don't stink. That they can do no wrong even. Um, they may get angry at times. They may, you know, blow their shit. Justice. Libra energy there. They have this, um, they have this feeling of wanting to make something right with you guys. But they're fighting change as well. Um, being that you guys are doing well, this person may have some legal issues. Um, they may have been married, maybe going through a divorce, or you guys may be going through a divorce with this individual, some of you. But there's a sense of wanting what they deserve. And for some reason, they feel like they deserve you. Um... But they, they want to make something right. But there again, you know, it's like there's a stubborn energy where they really do not like to take accountability for their actions here, okay? But they're feeling bad about something, definitely. Why is this happening? Why is this happening? Page of Pentacles. I'm getting somebody definitely wants to say sorry. And they're um, not intimidated, but they're um, they're they're a little on edge about approaching you guys here. 
They talk themselves out of it a lot. Okay. So I definitely don't see them physically coming towards you guys, but, um, not today anyway, not tomorrow, but I definitely see that the energy is definitely there. Okay. Yeah, they go back and forth. They're not sure what they want to do. They, I mean, they, they know what they want to do. They just don't know how it's going to be received and they're not comfortable with that. Okay. Um, they do not want to be rejected. So I'm surprised the two of swords is not here because it's like they're in and out. Like, I think I need to apologize, but no, they may shoot me down. Mm -mm. just just this constant state of not being sure but definitely knowing that they miss you they want to work with you feeling like they've done something wrong and wanting to apologize to you guys okay so we have capricorn um aries leo sagittarius sorry guys somebody's driving right on my line um aries leo sagittarius um libra Let's see, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio, and um, Cancer energies here. All right, guys, so that's what I have for you, and um, I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye.